Hi everyone. Happy New Year. So if you guys don't already know, y'all know already, I am with Child. And today we are going to make soup jumu. I usually make it every year. Last year I have my video, I have my video from last year where I used the backup squash. This year we were able to find some good squash because we went shopping early. So I'm gonna give you a little quick glance of my ingredients for this year and we will continue. Alrighty, so as you can see, these are our ingredients, our veggies and noodles that are gonna go in that big old pot. And over here we have our meat. My husband decided he wanted pork neck, pig neck. So it was already pre-seasoned the night before. And yeah. So over here, hubby's cutting up the squash for me because I do not have the energy to do it. Thank you. All right, guys. So my husband, if you haven't noticed, I already pre-cut the squash for me because um, I have no energy. And I have my water boiling already. So we're just gonna put that in the in the pot so we can. So when it comes to the squash, when you're using the pre-cooked one. It's pretty easy. You'll be able to actually have a, do it like this. I don't know why I'm trying to be fancy. We'll usually just start off with the vegetables and once we actually blend the pre-cooked ones, then I'll put the vegetables in. But since we already have real squash, I can start boiling that. And while that is going, I already pre-seasoned my meat from last night so my husband was in the mood for pig neck so i already have that pre-seasoned and we're gonna start frying it up and while all that is going i'm gonna be chopping up and cutting up all my vegetables and getting it ready to put the to put it in the boiling pot so while this is going we're gonna be frying the meat and I'll be chopping up. All right, let's go. All right, as you can see here, everything is all nice and chopped up. Got my celery, carrots, some plantain, got some yam, my langa. I got some green onions, of course, extra seasoning. Um, I am gonna put my own seasoning later. So we got the squash boiling here. And to our left, we have our pork neck here. It's fried and it's getting boiled so it can be nice and tender. Okay guys, welcome back. So now the jumu is all nice and soft. We're gonna take it out of the pot and put it in the blender. So we can blend it. So we can get that nice orange color. And we're making that soup. adding a little bit of cold water only because the fact that it is steaming hot we need it to clean out just a little bit before we blend it because if not it's going to be a disaster I learned the hard way three years ago <laughs> all right so we're going to blend it now that our squash is nicely blended we are going to start adding our veggies
going to add our meat into the pot. While everything is cooking, it's starting to get a little tender. We want it also to get all that flavor inside the pot. Squash. Soup I make has to have corn. But we don't add that in the corn. <laughs>
guys, her hubby's finishing it out for me because I am exhausted. I'm surprised I even last this long. So we're just taking the parsley out. And we also discovered that the stove on this side is broken. Well, mama's getting a new stove. So we're gonna slide that soup over and let that finish. But we are all done here. It's nice and thick the way hubby likes it. And that is literally the end of our video. We are going to eat now. <laughs> All right, bye.